begin with the arrest of a man wanted in connection to a hostage situation and pursuit in West Houston. Good evening, I'm Bill Barajas. HPD responded to the situation in the area of Almeda and Southmore Boulevard. A short chase began and the suspect crash near the intersection of Richmond and Yorktown. Our Rochelle Turner joined us live in the scene. Rochelle, you spoke to a witness there. And Bill, that witness heard the crash. He saw the suspect crash into this light pole. You can still see debris scattered on the ground and damage to that bush. Houston police tell us that this incident could be connected to another scene in a different county. Now, this all began around 1130 this morning when officers were informed of a possible hostage situation near Almeda and Southmore Boulevard. Officers later found the suspect on West Alabama and Sage road where a pursuit began. The car lost control and crashed near the intersection of Richmond and Yorktown. Officers said the suspect got out of his car, fled on foot. Officials recovered a weapon from the suspect and say a juvenile was a passenger in the car. The person was taken to the hospital with several injuries. I spoke to a witness who described the scene as crazy. One minute you hear the tires squeal, then another minute you hear pop where the car hit the light pole. The car did it like a 360 after it hit the light pole. Then you see a guy jump out of the driver's side and take off running. Now, we didn't even know there was a guy in the passenger seat. After that, like, when the guy started running off, then you see more cop cars pulling around. And police did catch the suspect. He was arrested and now he's facing charges for evading arrests and carrying an unlawful or unlawfully carrying a weapon. As for the person that was in the car, we do not know how serious they were hurt, but Houston police tells they are still investigating. It's also unknown if the suspect and the passenger knew each other. Reporting live in West Houston, I'm Rochelle Turner, KPRC 2 News.